So today on Project Shop, we are going to be sacrificing this uh, creepy statue to the scrap gods. And the weapon of choice we're going to use is this uh, variable speed, oscillating, 15 amp sawzall. So, you know, when you got to cut the head off a of bafflement, you really want some power. And you don't want to have to worry about batteries dying. So we got the corded one. And uh, shit, we getting right to work because I don't want this creepy motherfucker lingering around in my shop thinking he's just going to come over here and start sacrificing girls. Oh, man, we got our cut off. Oh, we're going we're going the wrong way. We got to cut we got to up cut. Get the jugular. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, man. Milwaukee made light work of Baphomet over here. Look at this. Yeah, look at you creepy motherfucker. What do we got here? A lot of brass. Well, there you have it. You know, we just destroyed probably, who knows, how many thousands of dollars this creepy ass statue was. I honestly want this thing melted down. You know what I'm saying? This this face here is just, uh, this thing's kind of disturbing. And, uh, yeah, that's what I think about you. Matter of fact, where's the pain giver? Oh, trying to get away, huh? Where are you going, dude? Got a little smush mouth going on? I'm just gonna give him a, little, a couple more little love taps, you know? We just wanna let him know how much we appreciate them. Woo! You know, we're giving him a makeover for free. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's looking better already. I really don't like his little horns, man. Want to get a little bit more bend on that horn there. Oh yeah. Huh? You don't want to. You don't want to give it up. Being stubborn. There we go. You got some bent horns, dude. Huh? Come around here, trying to sacrifice people? I don't think so. Not on my watch, dude. Look at that. Now you got some bent horns and a smashed in face. Looks like he just needs a little bit more touching up. All right. Yeah, basically split his face right in half. Now I can actually go home and sleep good tonight. Knowing this guy is not gonna be sacrificing anybody in my shop tonight, so. Trailing us, acting like they're writing shit in the sky, but they really spraying poison on us. That'd be some fucked up shit. We well, gotta pee now. You know, I don't know if doing this right over the damn interstate's a good idea. All these people looking up, they're liable to get having an accident. Oh, what's he doing now? Oh, maybe he misspelled it. Oh, it's a B. Wow. 
Looking like old Baphomet's having a bad day. Ha <laughs> He got smashed. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We ain't with this evil shit. Hey man, maybe just come up under here. Yeah, squeeze it hard. Squeeze it. All the way. Yeah, yeah, keep going, keep going. Was you gonna use it? very similar this one got four ladies with four jugs the other one each lady is holding a different thing that's pretty cool this one's got the lions this one doesn't have holes so this is like a bird bath basically all this copper. Oh, so for everybody saying that they don't take tarnished copper as number one, okay, this is all number one copper. I got number one copper for all that other stuff, which you'll see in another video. Because that is all number one. Well, there you have it. 1610 pounds dollar 80 a pound uh 2898 dollars even uh i paid 2500 for this so this was basically a quick 400 and the only thing i had to do was uh cut this dude's head off and then uh, you know drive it down to miami all right so now we're going to go look at some 500 mcm copper wire uh so we can get rid of this evil shit and bring some positivity back into my shop I'll tell you where we're going, right to the scrap yard. Dancing, you ever seen a copper dance before? <laughs> 